Hi guys, and here with a uh, guide for you today. If you've bought one of these Chinese import devices, you may find they've not got the Google Play Store on them, or they might come with the Google Play Store and you might factory reset for one reason or another, and they vanish, and you need to put them back on. So I thought I'd take you through how that's done. First of all, if you head to Google and just type in Google Installer APK, you should see the link at the top, hopefully the same as mine takes you to the MIUI, MIUI, MIUI forum. There it is. You might have to register, log in to be able to download it, but uh, that's where you'll get the installer file from. Right, so I've put it in the downloads folder, which doesn't particularly matter where. It shows up APK is one item. It was even at the bottom there, but so we're going to tap that. It tells us install is blocked. Um, Jamie's way of uh, protecting you, I suppose, is making you wait for the countdown because if you've pressed it by mistake, a bit of time you might realize. We say allow once, install, Google install and installing, installed, launch. So, this way you do need a Wi Fi connection, well, some kind of data connection at this point. And it can sometimes, I remember I've had to refresh a couple of times. There we go, look. Be patient. It will come through. There we go. So we're going to go to, for Google Play. And it tells us Google Play requires Google Service Framework. Yep, thank you. Now, we want to install the first three, but not the last one. So, yeah, I think that's fine. I'm not entirely sure what that bit means. And you can see it's downloading the framework. Once again, install blocked. OK. Meanwhile, Google Account Manager has been downloaded, I think, in the background, because that's a bit quicker. But once again, we've got a 10 second wait. Google Account Manager install. So this one's taking a little bit longer to download. Now, you'll notice it's jumped into the Google Play Store. We're going to cancel that one. Google Play Services, allow once, and install. OK. So, you'll see at this point we've installed the first three, not the last one. We're going to come back out. Well, we're going to have to come back out, but basically we're going to reboot. We're back up, so we're going. We're going in. We're going to run the installer, and now we're going to install the Play Store. If it uh, if it connects, fine. There we go. So now we should be safe to install the Play Store. And there we go. We're basically in. You uh, log into your Google account. What I would suggest, don't miss out some of these. So this one here is actually a contacts sync. I, I thought it was kind of automatic when you've got your Google account on the device. It was all done. That one's a calendar sync. Obviously, Maps, Chrome, Gmail, you can install through Google Play. But those top two... Um, are different to what I expected them to be, so you want to make sure you install those two. But apart from that, there we go, the Play Store is now installed on the device. My name's Andy, I'll catch you all again soon.